Yeah, I got slimmer, but I didn't get better. I didn't get healthier. I'm putting that in See, I was never once sat in the doctor's waiting room because of my weight. I was there because there's an evil man in my bedroom. He lives behind the glass and he points out everything wrong with me. He says my eyebrows look like they want to hold hands. And the only thing that will ever stand out about me, he says, is my guts. He says, nice bracelets. When are you going to get that necktie to match? When I finally lost all of the weight, he was the first one to point out that the stretch marks on the backs of my legs were disgusting. He said my spine bones made me look like a monster whose spikes were just trying to pierce through the skin. You see, beauty magazines, they don't only affect women. Every single airbrushed starlet that's got flawless skin and unimaginable proportions, she's eventually swept off of her feet by an equally beautiful Superman with a six-pack pecs and bulging arms. And that's why in every gym you will find young men screaming. I don't tell you this for a reaction. I just need you to understand that for me and so many others, this daily battle has got nothing to do with being thin. This is about learning to appreciate the skin that we are in, and it's a goal I am terrified I'm going to be chasing forever. So believe me when I tell you, I'm not getting fatter. I'm getting better.